All right, this one's called Boyfriend Doesn't Trust Me. Dear Pastor, I'm 30 years old. I'm in a visiting relationship. My boyfriend is 31 divorced. His marriage did not last long. as a hard time trusting women. <coughs> okay, so see where this is heading. He was born in Jamaica but came to America and finished high school there. He's a sweet soul and woman would like to have him. I have two boys and love him to death, but I'm not interested in having more children, but he wants one. He's very jealous. When my boy's father calls the house, I'm talking to him about the boys. He gets very jealous. To show him pretty there's one between us. I've never cheated on him. There's no reason for me to do so. I'm quite sure I'm not ha I'm happy in the relationship that we have. He calls all women cheaters, it bothers me. So now I'm a cheater. We have a very good sex size. How can this relationship go on if he doesn't trust me? That's a rhetorical question right there, sweetheart. The thing to do is uh do it do is that leave this dude alone. I mean, yeah, he, he may sound like a good dude that is very obvious with his previous marriage that is very likely that his so called ex wife did him dirty and he's put never forgiven her for it so and he's lashing the toes and teeth of all women including her so the thing to do is that one does does accept the fact that he said oh all women are cheaters meaning that he still has not given um he still has not let go of the past and yeah does it hurt to get your heart broken like that does it take time to heal yeah i think the thing she should have done is just give this us leave this guy alone let him suck bear the demons of his past if he chooses to because if he's if he's not going to forgive his wife ex-wife and is going to have trust issues that up to this day that basically means that hey does leave this guy alone wishing the best and just keep it keep it stepping because the fact of the matter is, is that he's making her pay for what his ex-wife did and you don't be in a situation with someone like that where they because things that people like that are not going to be satisfied and people like that are basically going to just keep using you taking all their anger on you frustrations on you no matter what you do and the thing to do with people like that just leave them alone I mean that the thing t to bear in mind is that okay if this guy has um refuses to like, get help or move on the past move on just leave it at that just basically just say, just say look whatever things i have for you um i'll best thing for you is just wish you the best hope you hope you heal emotionally and spiritually heal from what was done to you and just keep it keep it stepping because one thing you're going to understand is that he's not if he's made up his mind he can't trust you there's nothing you can do and as i said the best thing to just leave the dude alone just say you know what all right just let's call it today go your separate ways and she shouldn't worry about her children and whatsoever that's pretty much all I have to say. So, this is for State of Jamaica and the Caribbean. Check out my YouTube pages, Miles Gus and Farron, Miles Your Productions, Real Thoughts and Miles. All right.